from the New Horizon Cafe. Now I just wanted to bring you some words of encouragement from the Bible today um, from Psalms chapter 9 um, and verses 9 to 10 and they read The Lord is a stronghold for the oppressed, a stronghold in times of trouble and those who know your name put their trust in you. For you, O Lord, have not forsaken those who seek you. It's only two verses but it's so powerful. Now, I love words. I love words so much. <laughs> and I love researching words and their meanings, especially when I'm looking, doing my devotionals and my Bible studies. And I wanted to look up stronghold because I, I understood what it meant, but I didn't really know the gravity of it. And a stronghold is a place that has been fortified so as to protect it against attack. Our God, is a stronghold as we've just read here our God protects us from battle and from attack our God is there in times of trouble it says in here a stronghold in times of trouble our God is there for us fighting for us and making sure that we're safe and protected that that is just beyond incredible that our our God our God does that and it also says, and those who know your name put their trust in you. For you, O Lord, have not forsaken those who seek you. God doesn't forsake us. He loves us so unbelievably much that he fights for us. And he is taking care of us and making sure that we're okay. And if we call on him, then he will be here for us. Now, in my home, we have a poster of a poem called Footprints. Some of you might be aware of it, um, some of you not, but I'll briefly explain it here. So it's a person and God walking on the sand um, and looking at this person's life and the footprints of God and them along the, the sand. Um, as you you know, when you walk along a beach, you see you, you see footprints of people, or you can make your own. Um, but this this poem is him walking along with God about his life, seeing the footprints of his life. Now, in the hardest time of his life, there was only one set of footprints, and this guy was asking God. Why, why did you leave me? Why did you abandon me? You know, I went through this alone. How could you? As understandable as anybody would, would ask God, like, why did you forsake me in, in the hardest times of my life? And God says something in response, which is, I, will, I, I love this poem just for this. He says, I didn't leave you. I was carrying you. In the hardest times of our lives, it may seem like God is not there just because he's not answering us. But he is there, he's carrying us. He's being this stronghold, he's being this fortress. He's making sure that we are protected from anything, um, which is just, it's just beyond incredible. Um, I wanted to read another part of the Bible for you. Um, some of you might be familiar with it. Um, it's a very popular verse, it's Joshua 1 verse 9. And it says, have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be frightened and do not be dismayed. For the Lord your God is with you wherever you go. God is with us wherever we go. There is no reason for us to be worried because in every situation that we, we go through, God is with us. He is, he is holding our hand. He is making sure that we're okay. I just find it so encouraging to know that even in my hardest days, God is there. God is holding my hand. He's carrying me along the sand. He's making sure that, that he's there for me. So I just wanted to leave you with this, this little bit of encouragement today. Um, I hope you have wonderful weeks. Um, and yeah, love you lots. Mwah.